I'm starting with one of the wood carrots from the Dollar Tree as well as some pumpkin chalk paint and some green fern paint. So I gave it uh, a coat of pumpkin chalk paint for the carrot and then for the top of the carrot I gave it the fern green. So then now I'm just taking my fan brush and just a small portion of it. I take just a few bristles of it and I'm making a faux plaid pattern. This is my favorite way to make a pattern for my country projects and so I just go down vertically and then I go back across horizontally. And so then I'm going to add a bit of shading. So I just take a flat paintbrush and some paint. And my method is I dip half of my brush in paint, the other half in clean water. And then I blend on those blue paper towels. And then I go around uh, the outside uh, like edges. And then I go in some parts of the faux plaid pattern. And then uh, once that's dry, I just take my black Sharpie marker just for some extra uh, doodling and dimension and just really kind of highlight a lot of the areas and so I do the same thing with my uh, white paint and I just take my thin detailing brush and just go around and just add some doodling some squiggles uh, and just a lot of extras just to make my project pop then I will add some paint splattering and I do this with a stiff stencil brush and a stick and I just do some paint splattering now these tags uh, are uh, like paper bag feeling tags those came from Walmart and I just hand lettered carrots for sale and then I put my happy dots on there as well as I went back and added a white highlight in each of the happy dots just to bring them out a bit. Then I'm taking my distress ink in vintage photo and a finger dauber and then I go around and the tag crumple it up a little bit just for uh, texture and dimension and then I just take a few sprigs of raffia and just wrap it there around the top tying that tag on there as well and I have a cute little carrot for the spring season. I hope that you are all having a wonderful day and if you like these types of projects I would love it if you would follow along on my page because I do have lots of it, these fun country style whimsical projects. Thanks for watching guys we will talk to you soon and see you in the next video.